welcome to Candy Entertains. Today, I'm going to teach you how to make one of my all-time favorite recipes. It is my Asian grilled lamb chops. These lamb chops are absolutely divine. So let's get started. First, it starts with a simple marinade. So we're gonna start with a half a cup of soy sauce. And I just like to measure right into the measuring cup. It makes it so much easier. And we're gonna match that with a half a cup of dark brown sugar. Oops. <laughs> but from there, I like to add about one cup of chopped onions. about one heaping tablespoon of chili flakes. So with the soy and the brown sugar, we're creating like this sweet and salty cool vibe here. And onto that, about two tablespoons of fresh minced garlic. And if you don't like mincing garlic, you can also buy garlic paste, which is pretty popular in most grocery stores now in the produce section. Next, one of my favorite old time ingredients, is fresh grated ginger. This ginger is divine. I love cooking with ginger. It brings such a spiciness to a dish that you can't get from any other ingredient. So that's about, I'd say, two heaping tablespoons of freshly grated ginger. And then my last ingredient, which I love, is fresh cilantro. This is gonna be so delicious, guys. You don't even need to add any salt because the soy sauce has a nice salt component. You don't need pepper because we put in our red chili flakes for heat. And the ginger also will bring a nice little spicy component to our dish. When it comes to cooking lamb chops, you don't have to do much. The lamb itself is delicious, but just a few simple key ingredients can bump it up a notch. So now that our marinade is ready, we set that to the side. Here I have eight beautiful lamb chops that have been French, which just means the butcher has kind of cut off the fat. They're absolutely gorgeous. You wanna just add them to a large Ziploc freezer bag. This makes for a super easy cleanup when it's time to marinate your chops. So I just put the eight lamb chops in my freezer bag like so. And then we're just making sure our marinade is nice and combined. And you just want to pour the marinade directly into the bag. So here we're just going to continue pouring the marinade and all the ginger and the garlic and the onions, soy, brown sugar. You just want to squish it around like so. And my tip here, you want to marinate this at least four hours ahead of time just to ensure all those great ingredients infuse into your meat. If you can, do it 24 hours ahead, but it's not a must. However, I did some the night before that we're gonna grill up right now. So it's time to grill up our lamb chops. A little bit of a chef's tip, whenever you're grilling, take your meat out about 30 minutes before it's time to cook. That ensures you'll get a nice sear on your meat. So here I have a medium high cast iron grill pan that I've heated up. You wanna make sure it's well oiled. I put about maybe two tablespoons of olive oil or vegetable oil, whatever is your favorite choice of oil. And these chops I marinated overnight. So here we go. So we have, oops, that's the timer. Time to flip our lamb chops. We cook for about three and a half minutes on one side, and now it's time to flip. So our lamb chops are just about done. Turn our timer off. And so, if you're having a party, just a little entertaining tip. It's nice to serve these up on a platter like so. This makes it look a little more elegant. My Asian grilled lamb chops are complete. I wish you all could smell this. 
make sure you make this for your next party, or bay, whomever. It's really impressive and elegant. I have to buy the two of these. I love about lamb chops, they have these cute little handles. Super cute. Let's see, take a little cut. It's perfect. I like mine about medium, but if you like yours a little more done, just cook it a minute longer. Mm. The soy. The brown sugar, the ginger, all these great ingredients just come right through in that marinade. Trust me, you're gonna love this recipe. If you like this and want to see more awesome recipes, don't forget to hit subscribe. Until next time.